and Gates back. They're off and racing for the Coolmore Nunthorpe Stakes. Hot Streak on the near side broke pretty well. So to take cover in the red jacket and also Astaire blasting away as well. The sheepskin noseband. Rangali, the French Raider, is right there too with Stepper Point movie star chasing them. Just behind them, Shea Shea with extortionist Monsieur Joe Ste Steps is being pushed along behind them on the inside then comes uh, held on to the light blue jacket of G-Force together with Soul Power who's covered up Cougar Mountain. A little bit outpaced at this stage but he'll be staying on no doubt as they race on and crack on past the two furlong marker. A stare down the centre with Stepper Point. Movie star in the white sleeves is poised. Hot streak and the red jacket there take cover. Rangali's trying to come through. Shea Shea Soul Power is just cruising behind them. He'll need to find racing room pretty soon though. Stepper Point movie stars. They race up with extortions on the far side. Stepper Point just in front they race towards the line and soul power bursts through and grabs it what a ride by richard hughes he's won the nunthorpe on soul power they're off in the coolmore nunthorpe over the straight five furlongs if on the far side away well with mecca's angel in the nose band and thesme down the center with kotai glory and take cover showing habitual speed and at the end of a furlong it's take cover from thesme and mecca's angel and if far side and then kotai glory lamato white cap tracks and from gold dream brando prince of lear and yalta chase the leaders profitable midfield with washington dc then out do and silver rainbow eastern angel away to the extreme left soul power waited with Gokan pearl secret likewise to Towards the rear of the field, Dan Zeno chased along their past halfway on down inside the final two. Mecca's Angel and Thesme taking on take cover. Here goes Lemato with Gold Dream. Then Brando from Kotai Glory, Pearl Secret, Dan Zeno and Profitable. Mecca's Angel though in front inside the furlong. The heroine from 12 months ago. Lemato is trying to bridge the gap. Mecca's Angel is not for catching. Back to back wins of the Nunthorpe. It's Mecca's Angel again from Lemato. Very close for third between take cover and Kotai Glory. Chased home by the likes of Profitable, Thesby and Gold Dream. They're off for the Coolmore Nunthorpe Pearl Secret restrained on jumping towards the near side. So too Dandy Boy in a white jacket, far side. No surprise to see Hamish McGonagall away well. The great Massimar down the centre with Beyond Desire and Bogart and a noseband and then towards the near side, the left of the group, Tangerine Trees with a red cap. Tracked there by Bated Breath with the a pink cap. Then Monsieur Joe, Soul Power Extreme, left back to Tiddlywinks and Pearl Secret and Dandy Boy already moving down towards halfway. Spirit Quartz is chasing the leaders from Angels Will Fall and Confessional. Then Humidor and Nocturnal Affair or Tensor is taken off her feet, second from the right with a black cap. Secret Witness out the back with Invincible Ash as they race down to the last furlong and a half. Hamish McGonagall running a solo on the far side. Down the near side, beyond desire, the grey jacket. Spirit Quartz Maroon Jacket is thrusting between them. Baited Breath, Soul Power, Monsieur Joe, Tangerine Trees all trying to get on terms. Hortensia is absolutely flying down the far side. Spirit Quartz, Hortensia is gathering in. The line is looming, and it's Hortensia who had her nose down. The Aussie Mare lands the Dunthorpe. They're lined up, away they go, and a stumble for acclamation, and Continent missed it badly. Oasis Dream, in contrast, away like a bullet from a gun, and leads the way from Dominica on the near side as they scorch through the first furlong. Acclamation in the pot, in the spotted jacket is third, the tackling close up fourth, from, followed by Orientor and then Bahamian Pirate. The trader and Continent held up at the rear. Racing down towards the halfway stage, Richard Hughes is allowing the odds on favourite to use his full stride here and he's galloping into a length and a half leave over Dominica in second place. Acclamation is third. The tackling for Orientor, Bahamian Pirate, then the trader and continent. Oasis Dream is charging down the Navesmire here, running to the final furlong, four lengths. The tackling running a huge race into second place. It'll have to really go to catch Oasis Dream. Oasis Dream by four lengths. Europe's fastest horse. Oasis Dream win the nun wins the Nunthorpe. In second, the tackling. They're off for the Coolmore Nunthorpe. Ten sovereigns had to be stoked away from the stall. Second from the left, purple and white jacket. As ornate shows bright speed down the centre in the yellow silks to Soldier's Call. And then Copper Knight in the light blue, the white-faced El Astronaute. Ten sovereigns down the near side recovering. Batash on the far side in the raw blue racing in touch, being followed by So Perfect with a white cap. Then the great Garris on the extreme left, a rumble in the jungle. Mavs Cross in the red jacket, a switch second from the right. Extreme right now is Fairyland, and they've gone past halfway. And Batash has swept to the front here, storms into the lead now, passing the two. Soldier's Call is changed. Ten sovereigns out in the centre, purple jacket, three lengths to make up. Down to the 
last furlong. Batash has cleared away. Three, four lengths ahead with a wind at his heels. Batash simply scorching the turf on the next wire. It's going to be third time lucky as Batash takes the Coolmore Dunthorpe in devastating style. Soldiers call his second, so perfect ramp to into third. Close for fourth between Copper Knight and Mads Cross.